through today, but um, hippie? Fortune teller. Close enough. Ooh, I'll have to see if you can uh, read my future then, you know. Maybe there's a cute girl in there somewhere or something. You guys go sit down, I can come to your order. Thanks. Hello. Hi. Lavender shirt. Hi, purple scarf. My friends actually call me an ace. I'm Alex. Nice to meet you. Shall we sit down? Sure. Sure. Oh. So that's how you pronounce your name. Anais? <laughs> it's actually Anais. Right. You know, you wore purple today, and I knew that. That's why I wore purple too. <laughs> I think we agreed upon that. Right. Um, I think you've got four tattoos, don't you? Six, actually. That's what I meant. <laughs> Oh, what can I get you? Um, I think I'll have a pep peppermint tea. I knew what she wanted. Okay. I'll have the same. Thanks. Okay, uh, two peppermint teas. Sorry, I get really excited. There's this gift running in my family, so I knew what you wanted. Oh, cool. So, Shakespeare, huh? What? On your profile, you had a quote from Macbeth? <laughs> Like best. No, that was from American and Ashley movie. Oh. You haven't seen it. Correct. See? Told you I got a gift. Yeah. What else can you tell me? Hmm. I sense that you have a cat. <gasps> Two cats. And you guessed all that from my aura and not the cat hair on my shirt. Yes, and I can tell you more. I'm all ears. I think you're 29 years old and you work in a bookstore. Honey, that was all on my profile. I know something else. I think you're looking for a companion. Someone that understands you and accepts you for who you are. Oh, can I see your palm? Sure. Oh, I see. That's so interesting. What is? Oh. I can't really tell you. I mean, I don't really want to alter the course of your future or anything, if you know what I mean. Sure. Can we talk about something else? Okay. Um, you're... I don't mean more of you guessing things about me. Why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Isn't that the point of a date? Getting to know each other? Right, of course. Well, as you could guess, I, I make money as a spiritual guide. Is that what they call that? Yes. Um, but I'm also in the process of becoming an interpreter. I mean, I really love languages. I know a few of them. Oh, well that's interesting. Um, which ones? English, obviously. Um, Spanish, I know some Russian, a little bit of Mandarin, and French. Ah, mais tu parles français alors? Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, pas? C'est juste une connaisse qui aime bien ce futur de la guerre des gens, c'est ça? Oui? <sighs> you do realize that my name is Anaïs, right? There's like a 70% chance that I speak French. If only you'd been a little bit smarter, you would have picked a more exotic language. Pardon my French.
Are you laughing at me? Me? I would never. Right. <laughs> she didn't like the future you predicted for her, huh? I guess not. Yeah, well, no offense, but you kind of seem like a real piece of work. <laughs> What's your name? Alan. Hi. No. And I guess you've got me figured out. I'm pretty much a sheet ahead. <laughs> I'm curious to see what you're going to show up as next time. Cowgirl, astronaut, speaker, stripper, cat lady. Did you say streaker? <laughs> I also said stripper. Whatever. <laughs> you just have to wait to find out. Okay. See ya. Bye. too far and she walked out on me. What did you say to her? Well, I was pretending to be a fortune teller and a really gimmicky one at that. <laughs> Where do you come up with these ideas? I don't know. You know me. My brain is full of humanness. That you are. The only problem is she was actually really nice. Now I'm questioning myself about my behavior. I mean, I'm not really ready to be in a relationship, but even if she just questioned me, you know? But she just stormed off without even giving me a chance to make up for being such a goon. I mean, I can't even step into the territory without offending everyone. It's like making me feel like shit. <sighs> if Jeff finds out about this, he's going to give me hell. Yeah, but this just one time. Like, wasn't there another guy that you were talking to that you were really excited about? He was really shy or something? You know, it doesn't really all go that bad, but this is the second time someone's walked out on me. You've walked out on people too. It's not working, you're not gonna stick around. So you're gonna stop? Maybe. Not right now though. I've got a couple of dates set up, and I've got a couple of ideas I want to try. So, maybe not yet. But, if it goes south, then I'll give it a rest. Where are they? I'm gonna tell you. I don't wanna jinx it. You have to wait till after the date. And hopefully, I won't have a story of a dream being thrown in my face. Actually, that'd be one for the books. Can I come and sit at a table next to you and take videos? I can make it go viral. You could be famous. Famous a-hole? Yeah. No, thank you. Alright, alright. No videos, but can I at least come? <laughs> nope. You may not, Max. Never gonna happen.